helicopters normally land on the White House lawn. But what about planes? The first plane we're gonna try is the Savage Cub. This is a little ultralight and it should be able to easily do it. And just as I thought, not a big deal at all. Next is the Cessna Caravan. A much bigger plane, but still not that big. There's touchdown. And we got quite close to the White House, but we still did it. And now a cargo plane, the C-160, in case the White House needs extra supplies. Of course, this isn't even an American plane, but there we go. The C-160 as well with 20 knots of headwind did it. It was rough, but it counted. And now for the real test, we're in the 747 with a livery that could have become the new Air Force One, but unfortunately it didn't. I think it looks really cool. This is with 50 knots of headwind and there's our touchdown. Definitely a little bit early and not very smooth at all. But with the reverse thrust of these four engines, 50 knots of headwind, and a low payload, we landed a 747 on the White House lawn. 